Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you guys this in our pantry. So let's just get started. Up here I just have our snacky type foods. Down here more meal and things for meals. Down here more snacks because they didn't fit up there. And then I have more food down there as well. So I'm going to start down here. We just have ramen and sweet potatoes down here. I make up train case some of my husband's records. And then we have their plates right here. They're stained. They're not dirty. Don't worry. Um, we have some buttery smooth crackers down here because there's no other place to put them. Some fruit smiles. Two bags of cereal down here. Three boxes of oatmeal ones open. There's two packs left and two spare ones. And then we have Cheerios back there. And yeah. up here, got some Riley's baby foods, baby cereal, spaghetti leftover, Brianna sauce, some homestyle bakes, two things potatoes. Hamburger Helper, macaroni and cheese, protein powder I have in there for a while. We have some of these pasta sides. We're tired of pasta, so I've not been eating them. My seasonings for my ramen garlic powder. We have garlic salt, peanut butter, paprika, baby food, um, lemon pepper, apples. Here we have some gnocchi. Pesto and original can of tuna for tuna macaroni and cheese. Um, we have Miller Place Shake and hot cocoa back there. Salt. I always keep two soups on hand. So we have roasted chicken with vegetables. And then we have grilled stale line steak. I have country potato bread in my ramen bowl. So, yes, that's clean as well. Don't worry, guys. It's a stain. Pancake mix. Cans of beans. More peanut butter. Chili. It's been there a while. I don't eat chili that much. And I got the wrong chili. My husband doesn't like cheese chili. Basil leaves. Peas for that. Um, mac cheese and tuna. We have, I always buy one or two of these at a time. This is on sale. Citrus green tea. And then we have pineapple mango. Two things of gravy. Another soup, and I have a cream mushroom soup right there with that mac and cheese. Up here we have crackers, Riley's wild berry, um, yogurt bites, canola bars, some Oreo cookie bars, cheese wow. We have cheese up there too, of Nola pesto shakes and oil, um, banana puffs, more. Pasta chips. These were on sale at a Walmart, and my kids love these, but they're normally like three dollars a bag. So I picked some up and I stocked up on them. So you ha see a lot of them, but they don't eat them every day. Red crackers, normal crackers, right there, and we have some granola bars up there, and then these munchies that my daughter eats all the time. And these guys are amazing. If you have all these near you, I totally recommend checking them out. So the peanut butter ones. So good. I can't eat them at all because of my I have no teeth. Literally, I only have like two teeth. But my kids love them and they're good for them. So if you guys have kids, totally recommend trying these out. I had tried them before my oral surgery and I love them. So I'm kind of sad I can't eat them. But they are good and I can't get them here where I live. So I have to get have my grandma ship them down to me. So that's everything in here. I'm going to show you guys our fridge real quick, so give me a second. In our fridge, we have raspberries and blackberries, these juices. Bananas, because they're starting to go bad. Smactivia yogurt. We can have Riley's pear juice when she can't go. Spaghetti, I have to either eat or throw out because it's going bad. We have some syrup, some Capri Sun juices, and mushrooms. Then we have a burrito I need to finish in. Some soy milk, ranch, and then in the freezer we have pizzas and burritos. That's it. So that's everything, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. Please comment and subscribe.